the security this year. Right. Well, when you go to get a licence from Mendic Council, it's much easier to get a licence for a festival if you have Stuart Security. It's not supposed to be mandatory, I don't think, but it sort of is. However, what happened this year was that Stuart Security, thinking that the Green Gathering might be a little shaky financially, asked for 60% of their money up front. If they weren't going to get it, then they weren't going to do it. Fair enough. But then the date came and the date went. And the Big Green Gathering didn't have or didn't produce the money. And at that point, I guess, the contract with Stuart Security became null and void. Probably it wasn't the cleverest thing to say, ah, good, we can employ a cheaper firm. But I think that's what happened. Anyway, when Stuart Security heard about this, they were not at all happy. And Stuart Security are very interwoven with the police force and very in cahoots with Mendic County Council. District Council, whatever it is. Um, so, Stuart Security then went to the police and said, um, oh, these, or something like, these guys are a bit dodgy, they've pulled out of our contract, they've reneged on, on paying us, uh, we're not going to hang around, uh, there won't be any security, well maybe there will be but it won't be any good. I don't know exactly what Stuart Security said, but it was going to be something along those lines. And what then happened um, was that they, they go, um, what can we get on? And so they got them on the things that I mentioned at the beginning. The road closure, the shape of the road, colour of the road cones, the fire certification. Um, it's not to put any of these things down. Of course they're all necessary. But goodness me, wouldn't you think there was still a week and a half to go? We could have surely sorted something out at that point. <laughs> However, um, they really didn't want to do that. And incredibly, we are now left with a beautiful sight. Weather that's not too bad. Perfectly okay, no mud on the site, lovely weekend forecast, and nowhere to gather. Nowhere to go and celebrate together, and nowhere to enjoy being on the land and being in the elements with our friends and our mates. And I think this is really sad. I think this is the agenda, and I'm really would like to think that we could stand up to this and do something about it. Don't feel what's inside. Don't feel what's the truth.